It's so exciting. I love this festival. It feels like a real audience festival. Real moviegoers come, and I'm really proud of the film and proud to be a part of it. It was such an honor to get to work with him. I admire him so much. He's really one of my favorite directors, and and it was just a great, great honor, and he exceeded my expectations of, of the artist and the human being I thought he was before. Well, it's very much about Christian's character and um, his his sort of journey, but he doesn't know what he's seeking. It's, it's sort of the, the modern man's spiritual journey. There is a script, it's just different than most scripts. It's more of a suggested script than an exact script that you stick to. It feels good, you know. I mean, everyone tells me it's, 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 it's the right place for this kind of a film, and certainly with the interviews that I've been doing, um, you know, people really appreciate it, you know, and, uh, and I've always found in, in, um, in Berlin that uh, the, the, the questions are always the smartest questions that I get asked in the world, and so there's a real love of, of true filmmakers such as uh, Terry Malick. He's somebody who just loves to discover it as he goes along. You know, he's not somebody who has a goal which he demands you achieve. He's somebody who has absolute love of the process of acting, of, 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 of the director of photography, of all the different crew, and seeing what is discovered. You know, you can see he's got absolute delight in that all the time. So there's no wrong, there's no right in particular. It just is, you know, is it real? And so there, there's never any sense of a, a nervousness or demand. He's the most relaxed director you could ever work with. Yeah, very much. Yeah, yeah. Because you know, I, I never knew um, what I was going to be doing each and every day. Um, I, all I had was a, was a, a, an idea of who the character was, and then after that, I had no clue of um, who was going to be there. Uh, I had no idea if the people were actors or non-actors. Um, uh, Terry took advantage of the fact that I'm completely ignorant of, of, of many actors and everything, so he could tell me that they were genuinely whatever, and uh, uh, it turned out not to be true. I'd see them on the you know uh, posters and everything, but. Um, but it was always a surprise, you know, and he would just tell me kind of, all right, here's a, here's a, here's a real pimp in Vegas. Go talk with him. Let's see what happens. Um, but there was a great trust um, uh, between Terry and myself that uh, whatever happened was possibly useful, you know. And, and, and like people know with Terry Malick films, there's probably three, four versions he could have released. And this is the one that he, uh, he, he whittled down. <laughs>